U.S. State. So 3,500 dollars for that call. We sold 50 tickets, so we only need one more thousand in the car. So first of all, thank you to Happiness Co. We've got Cat Cafe, Sucks is Life, Villa Management, Baked by Erica, Niche Hair, Flat Center, Asher Garrett Makeup, CT, CKT Makeup, Bold Warrior, The Gifting Collective, Delicious Creations, Skin Solutions, CreateCon, and St. Isidore, who uh, were the sponsors of the door prize. So the reason that we're all here tonight is a couple months ago we found out about a cause, which is, if you haven't seen the shirts that both Chris and I are wearing, is for Operation Underground Railroad. So these guys go into places where there's sex trafficking, there's child trafficking, there's child labor, and they go in and they rescue the kids. They take them out, they prosecute the perpetrators, and they also help rehabilitate. Most governments can't do this because there's negotiation. They have to negotiate with all the other people that are a part of this. They have to go in there and try and build relationships with the governments. These guys just go in and get it done. We were fortunate enough to meet Tim Ballard, who you'll see in the documentary as well. It just reminds me that a lot of us in here are business owners. A lot of us are friends, clients, we're family as well that we've got here tonight, and we get to make a difference. Like we actually, with everything that we do, we can help other people. And that's really why I got into business. That's really what we do at Your Social Voice in the Funnel Division. What we like to do, and you know, the guys here all tonight, they don't get paid overtime for coming down either. They're here to help you guys so that we can all have an amazing evening as well. So what's gonna happen after this, we're gonna draw the raffle prize if you guys want to um, begin to leave here, and then we'll go in, and then on the way out we'll grab it. But we'll have just a quick uh, cap afterwards. Um, Julia from Happiness Co has been uh, kind enough to lend us five minutes afterwards just to give us a little bit of a wrap up on the evening. If the dollar was better, we would have saved two kids. Until um, <laughs> next time. So, uh, we'll get Christy who's done a lot of work. If you haven't met Christy, she is really the only one that was able to make this happen. All I did was roll some salami, that's about it. Why 62! I might draw this one just to make sure you guys don't stitch it up. Oh, it's me. We have I 50 white. Come up with your two gratitudes. Just 
give you some comparison to what you're feeling probably at the moment, but two gratitudes, and I'm going to steal the uh, family one, and I'm going to take away the children who's a parent in the room. Okay, you can't say your children, because that's an obvious one. Uh, so I want you to think outside of those two things. And ladies and gentlemen, get out of state. Thanks very much. So the OUR, the Operation Underground Railroad event is done and dusted, uh, the dust is settled and we were able to do a little bit of a reconciliation and look back at everything that we've done and we're able to raise over $2,500 which is amazing. So what we decided to do is we're going to keep pulling that until we get to the figure where we have one full child to be saved. So that costs $2,500 US dollars, so we have a few new clients coming on board in the next couple of weeks going to allocate a portion of that to them to really, really ensure that we can help these kids. So it was a tremendous event. Thank you, OUR. Thank you, Russell Brunson and Click for all that you've done for the charity and everything that you've helped them pull together. And we can't wait to help these guys even more into next year. We're really excited about it. So once again, thank you, because without the help of those guys going out and doing what they do, and also as well, our amazing clients, friends, families, potential clients that came down and were really able to give and help us and all the sponsors that helped as well. We had raffle tickets, we had bottles of wine, we had succulents, we had everything you can think of. Donated from some amazing Perth businesses. So really, thank you guys all so much. Tremendously grateful and honored to be helped by every single one of you so we can go and help more people and uh, look forward to doing more events like this into the future. And once again, thank you so much. Appreciate it. Oh,